Hallelujah. All praise, glory, and honor to Jesus. Amen. You know, when you look around the world today, we will find people so obsessed with their life, obsessed with their treasures, with their wealth, obsessed with their possessions, just obsessed with themselves. But I want to tell you, as you live on earth, as long as you have breath in you, instead of getting obsessed with self, you and I need to learn to lose ourselves in God. That you and I would be obsessed with God and God alone. When you read the story of the prodigal son, we see one of the reasons he began to experience a downhill in his life. He began to experience failure in his life was because he was obsessed with self. He goes to the father and says, you give me what is mine. Give me my share. And then he begins to live a life for himself, away from the father. And that was the reason he experienced failure, disappointment, discouragement, loss. When you are obsessed with self, life does not truly please you. You always will go through something or another that will shake you. But when he came to himself, when you read the prodigal son story in Luke chapter 15, verse 17 onwards, it says, but when he came to himself, he said, how many of my father's hired servants have bread enough and to spare and I perish with hunger? Verse 18, I will arise and go to my father and will say to him, father, I have sinned against heaven and before you. Now here we see him getting focused back onto the father. He says, I'll go back to my father. I will dwell with my father. And that's where we begin to see his life restored. I want to tell you, lose yourself in him and you will find yourself. It's only in him that you will truly find yourself. The son here, he moved away from his father's house and lost it all. He lost it all, got back to the father and found it all. I want to tell you, you may feel that the world has a lot to offer. You may feel, let's go and find life. Let's go and find treasures. Let's go and build possessions. Let's go and have that big house, the best car. But I want to tell you, as you get busy getting these things for yourself, you will truly be losing yourself. You will be losing life, losing peace, losing that joy, getting stressed, getting disappointed, discouraged, failures. But as you begin to draw close to God, you will begin to see God truly giving you life. You will truly be finding yourself. You will truly be understanding the true treasures of life. I want to challenge you. Lose yourself in God and you will find yourself. The prodigal son story, he went to find himself and lost it all. But the moment he went to the father's house, lost himself in the father. He began to connect to the father. His identity became the father and he found his life. Lose yourself in God and you will find true life.